Hello guys, welcome to TechBuzz. If you are an iPhone user, you may know that Apple products have one of the tightest security system and bypassing them is really hard, especially removing the iCloud activation lock, which occurs due to forcefully resetting an iPhone without disabling Find My iPhone and removing Apple ID. And this situation can occur when you bought a used iPhone with someone else's Apple ID already logged in or you forgot the password of your Apple ID. But today I'll show you how to remove iCloud activation lock from iPhone in just few minutes. For that, we will use Tenorshare For Me Key app. For Me Key can help you to bypass most of the security features of iPhone in just few clicks like iCloud activation lock up to iOS 16.3, remove iCloud and Apple ID from iPhone and disable Find My iPhone without password. You can also log in with your Apple ID in App Store after bypassing iCloud activation. You can also use it to mute camera sounds on some global units of iPhone. It's available for both Windows and Mac PC. The link of the app is mentioned in the description below. You can check the details from the link. Although this app is not free, but it's worth of every penny as it's a very feature-rich app and has a very simple interface. We will use iCloud activation lock feature in this video. But before going ahead, make sure you are using the latest and official version of the app to avoid any issue. Now we will click on start to remove for bypassing iCloud activation. Now connect your iPhone to PC using the USB cable. My iPhone is iPhone 10 running iOS 16.2. The device is being checked and you can read what all things can be done with this app. So the device is now connected and your iPhone should be on the activation screen or iPhone lock to owner page before starting the process. And during this process, you have to put your iPhone into DFU mode twice. And during this process, do not disconnect your phone and make sure only one iOS device is connected to PC to avoid any confusion. Now we'll click on start. Now the app will put your phone into recovery mode. Once the phone has entered recovery mode, it will show connect to PC logo on the screen. Now follow the on-screen instructions to put your phone into DFU mode. You can select your iPhone model from the top and follow the procedure accordingly after clicking on start. When iPhone enters into DFU mode, the app will automatically move to the next step. For Mickey app is now jailbreaking the device and it may take around 3 to 4 minutes and you can see the logo on the iPhone screen. Don't touch or disconnect your phone. Jailbreak has been installed successfully on my iPhone 10. Now we'll click on start to go to the next step. Now select your iPhone type from the top and follow the steps shown on the screen to put your phone into recovery mode. So now connect to PC logo has appeared on the screen means the phone has entered recovery mode. Now click on start and follow the on-screen instructions to put your phone into DFU mode. Once the phone has entered DFU mode, the app will automatically move to the next step and app will start iCloud activation removal process. It may take around 5 minutes so sit back and relax. You can see some codes running on the screen. Don't touch or disconnect your phone until you get a process complete message. The process is complete and the phone is booting up now. So still it displays iPhone logged to owner. But let us check by doing all the usual setup steps. So it's asking whether I want to apply any lock screen password. I'll choose it to do it later. And as you can see, it's asking for a new Apple ID, means the previous owner's Apple ID and iCloud activation lock has been removed successfully. So you can now enter any new Apple ID or you can do it later on as well. But please read the warning on the app where it says factory resetting your iPhone will lock your device again. And if you want to sign into your Apple ID, then do it from the app store and not from the phone settings. And on iPhones with Apple A10 or Apple A11 chip, do not apply lock screen password else the phone will enter into DFU mode and you have to do the iCloud activation process again. So the setup of phone is complete and the phone is back to the home screen. It has wiped out all the data on the iPhone like photos, messages but thankfully I have gained access to my device. And as you can see it has removed the Apple ID of the previous owner. So removing iCloud activation lock was really easy with Tenorshare Foamy key. You can download the app from the Tenorshare site, the link is mentioned in the description below. You can either buy a monthly, yearly or lifetime license as per your need. Also on the occasion of Tenorshare's 16th anniversary, there are some great offers available from 10th May to 8th June. Like you can get $200 Amazon gift card and everyone has a chance to win up to 30% off coupon code. You can also get best deals on other Tenorshare softwares as well. Details on how to join and win exciting gifts are mentioned on the website and I have provided the link in the description as well. If you have any doubts regarding the Tenorshare For Me Key app, you can ask me in the comment section below. If you enjoyed the video, do hit the like button. Also, don't forget to click the subscribe button and press the bell icon to get updates on our new video uploads. Also, follow me on Instagram on techbuzz.insta page and techbuzz Facebook page. We will be back with another video soon. So till then, stay tuned.